This was past me. Past me was not thinking about future me. Past me just wanted to have a good time, get lit, finesse some guys, and go home. But sometimes life happens and shit goes down. So maybe even though you're not planning to wake up dehydrated, confused, and full of regret, you somehow find yourself in that predicament anyway. First things first though, whenever I get home from a lit night, I've really trained myself to do my skincare routine and drink as much water as possible. Taking off your makeup is so crucial, so keep makeup wipes by your bed, keep water by your bed. So flash forward to when I wake up. You know, this is where the water next to the bed comes in handy because at this point I'm too lazy, unmotivated, dizzy, and just confused about my life to really get up and do anything. After I lay in bed for a little bit and give myself a lecture about how I'm never gonna do this again and how I really need to get it together and who do I think I am, it's time to get up and cleanse my sins. I try to stick to products that have some kind of caffeine in them, like coffee grinds, also things that are peppermint or eucalyptus scented. If you use a coffee scrub or a caffeine eye cream, it's just going to brighten up those areas and make it look more, more alert and more awake. And I do this stuff when I'm not even hungover, but just tired. I also brush my teeth. This is really crucial, especially if you puke. Really try not to get to that point. Brush your teeth regardless, please, brush your teeth. So now I definitely feel a little bit better about my life, a little more awake. Things from the night before are starting to come back to me and I begin to realize, you know, oh, it wasn't so bad, or oh, wow, I really wish I didn't remember that just now. But nevertheless, now I like to go out to my kitchen and start diffusing some peppermint or eucalyptus oil as well. I then will drink more water, and if I have a vitamin water or some kind of like electrolyte beverage, I definitely try to drink that as well. Something else that I really try to do is to not drink coffee because coffee is actually super dehydrating. So if I want that caffeine, I either go for like some sort of energy drink, natural energy drink, or a tea. I really like chai tea, black tea, green tea, like any tea with a caffeine in it. And it's just gonna be a little less dehydrating, but still give you that caffeine. Here I have some chai. I'm just really trying to get through this. I love that these are all also tips and tricks that I do if I've been on a flight, didn't get enough sleep. You know, it's just kind of the dehydration and the tired that you really need to combat. Depending on how disgusting I feel, I have an array of different supplements and pills that really just help me get back on my feet. Activated charcoal is the number one thing I would recommend. It really helps to absorb any toxins in your system and really like flushes them out. So I definitely recommend getting this. It's like six dollars on amazon then we have ibuprofen of course probiotics which i also recommend taking these before you go out and then i also have some cbd oil which this also really helps if you feel like tired or just have a headache or just feel like you want to die i don't always take all of these but it's just a few things i like to have on hand and of course continue drinking water then i just like to do a light sage cleanse to you know just really get off all the bad energy of all the guys that tried to hit on me or all the guys that i ran away from after they bought me a drink i find this step to be crucial in my morning routine and you know if you're ever just in a bad environment just doing this real quick when you get home really helps to make you feel better about your life so then i might still feel like i just want to sleep for the rest of my life um but you know i try to get myself together and maybe reply to a few emails edit a video just do something productive that lets me know that I'm still on track to a successful life and career. <laughs> but again, depending on how late or lit the night was, I usually just kind of end up coming over to my couch and sitting down, lying down, and taking a nap for several hours. By that time, it's the afternoon or maybe even the evening. At that point, I'm just kind of ready to do it all over again. So let me know in a comment what your morning routine is, whether you're lit or, you know, healthy. Health is truly wealth and sometimes you need a little bit of wealth to just balance out the health. <laughs> if you are going to be drinking, just be healthy about it. Know your limits. Don't overdo it because it really is so unhealthy for you. But still, I would love to hear your tips and tricks like on a serious note. Like what do you genuinely do if you wake up and you're just like, fuck. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Snapchat to see my antics. <laughs> and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye everyone.